Last time on Dreamfall Chapters. This one is the first dreamer. This one dreams. And the dream is the universe. When the dream ends... What, what's happening? Where are you going? It's all in there, all you need for a full expose. It's dangerous information, Sully. Even the possibility that Unity might be mixed up in something objectionable makes it impossible for me to lend my support to the campaign. Records, financial transactions, documents linking Unity and Ominska to Watercorp and Wolf. What is up guys, my name is The Happy London and welcome back to Dreamfall Chapters Book 2. Let's get right into the action because this is the last part. Enjoy it! Oh wow, so many cutscenes. Thursday, August the 10th, 2220. Now we are back at Zoe. So maybe this is where the stories come together now. What is it, Zoe? Why would I put on a dream machine? They are evil. Alright, um, do I have goals or something? Journal. Ah, uh, well, shit. That's a good beginning. Thursday, really already? What next? Thursday? I've been going over things in my head for over a week. Did I do the right thing, giving the data to Sally and the hand? They're still working on the story, but it should be ready any day now. I know they have been doing a ton of fact-checking and background information. They know this is going to be huge once it's published. So I guess I did the right thing, but yeah, no, I'm not sure. Well, I'm sure about that. You're fine, so you are totally fine. Uh, so what now? Take it. I don't want to put it on, but the game wants me to, so, hey. It's not gonna work if you just stare at it. Alright, I'm not putting it on then. That's great. Mira, do you have a second? Depends. Are you done? I need those bots to go out tomorrow. Almost done. I, I was wondering if I could leave a teensy bit early today. Be kind. Rewind. Almost? Mostly. I'm mostly done. In your experience, <laughs> Petal, what's my answer to a question like that? Nope. Uh, one filled with expletives. But it's really important that I... Of course it's fucking important. It's always important. It's never not important. You wouldn't be asking if it wasn't important, would you, Kutria? So what's so important that you feel it takes precedence over the work I pay you to do? I have an appointment with the editor of The Hand. They're doing a story and... And he can't do this story without you. Even though he's a professional reporter and you're a... a what are you again? <laughs> you tell me. Most of the time I'm running errands. I should be programming. Should is a big word. I should be making a million yuan. I should not be forced to run my operations out of a murder chuding garage. And you should be grateful you have a job that pays a decent salary. Decent? A salary. Go on, get out of here before I change my mind and make you work overtime. Just be here extra early tomorrow to, I don't know, what do you hate doing the most? <laughs> Sitting at my terminal learning more about neural programming. <laughs> I really, really hate that. Mopping yeah, of floors. course. That's it. You'll come extra early to mop it. the fucking floors. <laughs> right. Yes. Fine. Sure. 
Alrighty then, let's go outside before she um, makes us do some overwork. Alright, out. We got our goals updated. Go to Sully at the hand that feeds. Alright, so my phone is calling. At the moment. For any questions pertaining to the Leo Minska campaign, please. Why are there eye operatives? They haven't been here before. What? What's happening? What do you mean you won't let me in? You will let me in. This is my office. Step back, citizen, or I will be forced to I shoot. I will not step back, you pisslick. You'll have to shoot me where I stand before I. Sully? What's going on? Christ on Darby, Sully. You shouldn't be here. We have an appointment. Ah, Kasha, of course. I'm such a salaka. I should have messaged you as soon as I. Our offices were attacked last night by masked goons. They trashed everything our screens, our furniture, everything. When I called in this morning, these things show up. Battle suits, syndicate agents. They take our equipment away, interrogate my employees. And now they refuse to let me back in my own fucking office! What? Why? They claim we're under investigation. Us! We're the victims here! Alright, so the data is gone now. Story. Perfect. We can't publish anything right now. They've confiscated our data banks and terminals, cut our wire access. Even my iris is displaying an error message. They have been exceptionally thorough. But the data is safe. Our research is safe. We've learned our lessons. We keep everything on offshore servers in Iceland. No amount of court orders, corporate threats, or military action can get to that data. But for the time being, that's also where it stays. If we try to access it remotely, they'll intercept our connection. If we try to publish it, they'll stick us in the gulag. All right, so it's locked down, but we can access it. What else could it be? We were this close to revealing a connection between the eye clamped down, several of the political parties, and the Wati controlled syndicate. So, what's going to happen? Right now, nothing. We sit tight, let them believe they've silenced us. And then we find a way to publish. Your man, Al. Reza caught the first fact tracks north this morning, carrying three very expensive and very, very secure hollow maps. He'll retrieve our backups and then we'll take it from there. Reza did what? He didn't tell me. How did he get out? He got out by not telling anyone he was getting out. He disabled his iris. Used a disposable identity, got smuggled across the river in an empty container. He'll try and get in touch as soon as he's made it safely to Iceland, but he will need to be careful. You can bet your god they're monitoring every channel of communication. I guess he's not there yet. Oh shit, Sully, I feel responsible. You just handed us the story of the year. The fact that they'll go to such lengths to silence us is a good thing. But you do need to watch your back, Zoe. He has every chance what the cops keeping an eye on you as well. The clamp down is their doing, behind the cover of the syndicate. They want people off the streets into dream time, for whatever reasons. Which is why they're buying political power. Exactly. Yeah. We have proof that both Unity and the European Dawn are in their pockets. Whoever wins the election will be under what is thumb. It seems the only party that isn't being run by the corporations is Manifesto. It's not like they're going to win the election. If we are able to publish our story before the election, who knows? Never underestimate the collective anger of the masses. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm getting a call. Is it Reza? No. Mela. Why would she be calling? One moment. Is this a bad time? Um, yeah. It's fine. What's up, Mela? No, okay, I it's fine then. Can we meet in the shock? No problem. I'll be there in a minute. Thanks, Zaza. Oh, I... I need to run. Can we talk later? You bet. I'm gonna do my best to make life difficult for these bastards. But I'll call you. Alright, take care, Sally. So we are going... in the shack. Alright. Meet Naila in the shack. Um... 
Mount Agius. Alrighty. Thanks for coming. I just need a favor. I need you to hold on to this for me. What? what is it? Something personal. Box. Will you keep it Great. safe? Sure, sure. But why? What's going on? I don't want it to get lost or why would it? Nella, you're making me worried. Are you involved in something? Don't worry about it, Zozo. Just keep that safe for a little while. I'll get in touch soon. Thanks for coming so quickly. I have to run. But I don't... I really have to go. There's something I need to... to do. Bye, Zoe. What? She looked freaked out. Maybe I should follow and make sure she's okay. Follow Nela. All right. Is she going straight to the Vatikop building? She's going straight in, isn't she? All to run! Oh my gosh! Bella! Can we catch her? I don't think so. Boom! Oh shit. She blowing herself up? Fuck! The hell, Nayla? Am I still alive? Hopefully. Stay safe. Stay inside. Stay in touch. Shut up. Just stupid Watticorp ads. I liked Nayla. Why the hell? She just died. Come on. Now I'm back in dream time, right? Oh, you can't leave me with that. Come on, no. What? No. What? No. No. What? Oh, come on, no. <sighs> Alright. <laughs> anyway, um, all your decisions have been recorded for book three. I don't know when book 3 will come out, because they haven't announced it by now. All 5 books should be coming out this year though, so we will be able to play them this year and I will play them right after they come out. So, yeah. Anyways, the story is awesome so far, I love it. This was like a what the fuck ending for me, I don't know what happened there. Nayla just blew herself to pieces, the end. And I am in a coma, again. <laughs> what? <laughs> Can't, you can't end a book like this. That's no, no, no Red Sword games. Don't, don't do that. So this is something like a lean back series. I don't know. It's an adventure game, and you can just watch the story with me. I think that's pretty cool. All right. So I see you guys on the next book, book three, and yeah. Till then, as always, leave me a like down there and a comment if you enjoyed this. Don't forget to subscribe, and I will see you on the next one.